Hello my dear friends and welcome again to Adventure Story Channel videos about marine engineering. Today my dear friends we will talk about the emergency operation of mission oil boilers. First of all we have the access to the local panel of the boiler where we will operate all the system for the emergency operation. This is a really rare case that your PC has gone, you have this damage on your PC, and you cannot use it uh, from your uh, computer from the engine control room, so it will be necessary to attend to the local panel. First of all, we turn the key on the number 7 to the manual position on the local panel of the boiler. We start the fuel pump in manually, and we attend to purifier room, we're going down, and we adjust the pressure to the line from 18 to 20 kilograms. This adjustment will be made manually by adjusting the fuel automatic regulating valve and some of the ball valves for the return. After that, we verify that our fuel temperature varies from 115 to 120 degrees and make the appropriate adjustments from the preheaters. The next step is to start manually the fan of the boiler. So we are going for purging. We set to 70% the purging for 60 seconds to obtain a good purging. To obtain that we just turn the potentiometer with number 5 and we check the load and we monitor the percentage on the LCD monitor which is in our case here located in the number 2 number of LCD displays. We successfully finish our purging and now we are ready for the ignition position. Now we lower down the fan capacity to 25%, we check that in the monitor number two and also we fix the fuel supply with number three potentiometer for the oil flow to 24 percent all the adjustments for airflow and for the oil flow again will be made with the potentiometers the next step is to press the atomizing steam valve number 12 to open the atomizing steam valve now it's necessary to adjust the atomizing steam pressure to 3.5 kilograms by hand by regulating the automatic valve of the atomizing steam. To open or close we will see the arrows locally and necessary we will adjust by hand. Now our boiler is ready for firing by pressing the ignition button in our case number 8, we are sure that there is a flame presented in our space and we see that the two flame relays has energized, in our case number 13. We hold the button, we keep the button hold and at the same time with the other finger we press the oil valve number 9 to open the fuel valves. Now we are in run, now the main flame is on and we have flame on or R indicators number 11. We lift our both fi fingers from 8 and 9 position numbers and now we can increase or decrease the load with our help of our potentiometers number 5 and 6 which is represent air damper combustion air fan and oil flow regulating valve. For adjusting the level of the boiler, we will do it with the potentiometer number 4 for the water level. For switch of the boiler, we just press the stop button number 10 for more than 20 seconds. In that period that the button is pressed, there will be initiated the steam purge and now we are ready to close the automatic valve of atomizing steam manually. 
Also, I would like to inform you that there is different types of actuators. So, depending on type of actuator, there is a different engaging system. For the type of actuators 2.2 to 5 kN, it's not necessary to engage any button. On the other hand, for actuators type from 12 to 15 kN, there is a engaging button for manual mode. Please verify that there is not any power supply provided to these actuators because damage to the gearing system can be done.